Hi, it's Mr. Dorick from the Computer Classroom. In today's lesson, we are going to learn how to design your own hoodie or t-shirt or other items that they have on Bonfire. So the first thing you wanna do is create an account on Bonfire. We have our Computer Classroom store right here. I'm gonna click on my dashboard. So you will see the total profit the classroom has made, how many sweatshirts, t-shirts we've sold, and then what items were sold. So what we're gonna do, we're going to go to the store, and under menu, you're gonna scroll down to product catalog. And we can do t-shirts. I'm going to do, there's kids t-shirts, tank tops, mugs, we did face masks in class. We haven't done hats. I'm just going to do a basic sweatshirt. And I like the hoodie, so I'm going to select the hoodie. And then I'm going to click on the green button, Start Customizing. All right, so it gives you the hoodie, and it's pretty much three basic steps. You design it you buying it or sell it, and then you finish. So we're gonna go through these three steps. The most important thing I think students kind of overlook are these little colored, colored choices where you can add up to six, oh, is it five? No, it's five colors of your choice. So I like black, purple, I wanna do like a red, one, two, three, four, five. I have five colors and I'm gonna keep it on black. I'm gonna design it on black. Okay, so I got the colors, and then I'm gonna click on Next. Oh, cancel and edit. I'm sorry, I went too fast. I'm gonna go up to Add Text. You can find graphics that they give you over here, and you can upload your art. If you do upload your art, it's gotta be basic, um, probably eight colors or less, I believe. So nothing with more than eight colors. It's very hard to get your own original picture. You'd have to remove the background and play around with pictures. Nothing copyright. You can't get a picture of LeBron and, and sell a sweatshirt or your hoodie. All right, so I'm just gonna do something very basic. I'm gonna add text. We're gonna do a rest in peace DMX hoodie. We're gonna click on add text. And then you see the other text behind it. So I'm just going to click on it, and that little X, I'm gonna delete it. That's the printable area. You can change the font right here with the given font styles. I actually like that one. And we wanna make sure it stays in that printable area. You can use the arrows on the keyboard to kind of center it perfectly. You can change the color. I like the white. I'm just gonna keep it very basic. Keep it white and black. You could center the text, rotate it, so on and so forth. So we're just gonna keep it very simple. You can also design the back of it. Let me move, show the back if you want, but we're just gonna keep it on the front and then we're gonna click on next. Now we're gonna start selling it. Bonfire does all the manufacturing, they do all the printing, they do everything. We're gonna estimate we're gonna pretty much sell one. They pretty much give us a suggested cost, $30. Um, that's how much it costs them. We'll sell it for $37.99 and for each one sold, sold we're going to get $7.85. So we can change the selling price. 45. I don't think it lets you do like 100. I think the max is 70. So it's going to tell you what the max is. So we'll just do 50. So at $50, we're going to make $19 in profit. So you're going to click on next. We could do this as a fundraiser for the school, for the classroom. I like setting the batch every two days. This way, if you have someone who orders it, 
in two days if they're going to produce it and ship it out so they don't have to wait. Usually we'll do, if it's a longer fundraiser, we'll have 20 days to sell it. We're not doing a fundraiser, so we'll just do two days, make money, always accept tips. Why not? If someone wants to send us a tip, that would be great. First batch will end on April 14th. We're going to do, let me pause this and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So I had an important text um, message. So going back. Okay, so we did two days. You're going to scroll down. If you are, you want to describe your campaign. I always put school. Some teacher over there. We can do this for a club. I just do it for my computer classroom. Sometimes I'll do middle school. I teach at the high school, middle and elementary. Uh, school spirit. Teacher. You could put some additional tags. Standard, and then you're going to click on next. You're going to add a title. Describe your campaign. Uh, whoops. R-I-P-M-X. I can't type. Tab. R-I-P-M-X. And then you're going to launch it. Once it's launched, you agree to their terms and conditions, confirm and launch. And that's just pretty much any copyright. They're not going to print it. So if you had a picture of DMX on this hoodie, they're not going to print it. But this should be fine. It's just text. And you can share it. You can edit this in the dashboard once it's live. You can see your store. Edit the store. You're going to add the campaign to the store. I'm just going to do this real fast because you'll see I have a whole bunch of student designs. Uh, you reached the campaign limit. Okay, so I'm going to have to delete. So, so I just, this is a t shirt. I want to add the hoodie. I'm going to delete one of these student designs. This is, we'll delete this one. Save and update. And now we can add the DMX. So unfortunately, with Bonfire, they give you a limit. I don't know the exact number, but if I have probably over 25, I'm guessing. So now we have the hoodie. You'll see I did the t-shirt earlier today. Then we're going to save an update. And then it's live. This is pretty much the link. You can even, if you have a Facebook, you can share that link. You can advertise it. You can do uh, Twitter. And that's pretty much it. So what I do, I usually just save the image. Save image. I save it real quick. And this is the computer classroom. I put it on the merch section. Right here, all the student designs, some like uh which one i did a few for my niece nephew like these i designed and then the rest in peace you're gonna see the hoodie we'll just put that right there and i'll just put that on the wix website upload the picture and then you'll see it so i'm gonna do that but i'm not gonna show you how to do that we're just gonna this lesson was pretty much just on bonfire so that's it's so easy you just have to Get a bonfire account it attaches to your paypal once you see the campaigns are here you have the store you can take a look at the computer classroom store and then one two if you have the time you can even count how many products four five six seven you'll see it's a lot eight we did face max nine ten and these are all student designs some that are inappropriate i don't i try not to i try to get them off the store like this probably won't get printed if we were to ever try to purchase it pop smoke just reading that that won't get printed so these are copyright we do it for fun this would get printed this is an original technesium and in the back that's a cool design all right so that's bonfire hope you enjoyed it thanks bye Okay, so real quick, this is the Computer Classroom website, and this is the merch section. 
So you'll see we have a bonfire store that I just showed you how to do and then Teespring. So just focusing on bonfire, these most of these are done on bonfire. And I'm just gonna scroll down and this is all pretty much student. Unless you see like the girly ones, those are the ones I designed for my niece. We are all boys school, so you're not gonna see too many. LOL. Oh, girly girl design. And then you'll have that. Oh wait, and I have to add, you're gonna see the hoodie. So then once you click on it, it's a direct link that takes you to Bonfire. And that's when you can purchase the hoodie or, oh, that was a t-shirt. I gotta fix the links. Thanks, that's it. Bye.